Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Prayer to the Lord. Lord, send a great awakening to Egypt, to Syria, Iran. You can do it, Lord. You're moving Israel, Jerusalem, Haifa, all across Israel, Lord. Bethlehem. Lord, do it. Come, Lord Jesus. Galilee. Hallelujah. And when Elijah had called down the fire, the people were prostrate on their face. When he comes, all you can do is lay on your face in the presence of the Lord. The glory of God had returned to Israel, and that's what you need in the nations. You need to pray that the glory of God will cover your nation as the waters cover the sea. He is able to do it. But Elijah wasn't finished. Oh, Ahab was finished. All the others were finished. They had their sacrificial meal. They had their lunch or whatever. But where was Elijah? This great intercessor. He was up on the top of the mountain of Carmel where we are now. And he was laying down. He was curled up in a fetal position. He was birthing prayer. And he said, I hear the sound of the abundance of rain. And we say to the nations, you need to hear the sound of the abundance of rain for your nation, for Israel, for the Middle East, the sound of a great revival. We need to get on our knees like Elijah. He heard it. Nobody else heard it. Lord, we ask you to release that sound here today, the sound of the abundance of rain. His servant kept running back and forth on the mountain, said, I don't see anything. I don't see anything. And then he saw a little cloud, like a shape, like a man's hand in supplication, in adoration, a picture of an intercessor, a little cloud over Mount Carmel. He said, tell Ahab, get in his chariot because the rain is coming. We've had a vision of a great, wonderful cloud bank from all the way across the Sea of Galilee to Mount Carmel, and the Lord said, these are the prayers of the saints from the nations and from Israel. I'm waiting to pour out my spirit in northern Israel, and I hear the sound of the abundance of rain, and I know the Lord wants to do it. And he's looking for a people that will pray and pierce the darkness, pierce the clouds, and down will come the rain. Let's pray for the rain right now. Lift up your hands. Lord, send the rain. Send the rain of your spirit, your cleansing rain to the nations. Lord, we hear the sound of the abundance of rain. Release it, Lord. Lord, send the rain. Send the fire. Send the rain. Send the wind. We want it all, Lord. We want another Shavuot. We want another Pentecost. We want you to really release something awesome this year, this now, Lord, 2015. We believe, Lord. We believe for a great harvest of souls. Bring them in. We see them coming, Lord. We see them coming. You said you will shepherd your people on Mount Carmel as in the days of eternity. In Micah 7, 14, Lord will do it. Shepherd your people on Mount Carmel as in the days of eternity and do it in the nations. You are the good shepherd of each nation, Lord. I pray, Lord, that you will raise up prayer warriors in the nations who will pray for their nation and pray for Israel and Islam like never, ever, ever before. Thank you, Lord, for what you're doing. You said you would shepherd your people on Mount Carmel would be like in the days of eternity. Hallelujah. We thank you, Lord. Yes, you said sure. the glory of the Lord will be returned to Lebanon yes. and to Carmel. Lebanon's 25 miles away. Lord, send the glory to Lebanon where Hezbollah is. Send the glory to Mount Carmel. Send the glory to Galilee. Guard the northern border, Lord, and send prayer warriors. Lord, bring prayer warriors here from the nations. Some of you watching us today, come up to the Mount Carmel. Get in the prayer watches. The ones in Jerusalem, come and pray for the salvation of Israel. The Jews are going to turn to Jesus, and then he's coming back. If you want him to come back, you need to be prayer warriors for Israel. We believe you're doing it even right now. You're releasing, you're releasing the sound of the abundance of rain. Oh, I hear it. Thousands flocking to the Lord. Thousands. Bring them in, Lord. Lord, you are the Lord of the harvest. Send out your harvesters. Bring them in, Jews, Arabs, Gentiles from the nations, the one new man of Jew and Gentile, created to be a dwelling place for God in the spirit, the restoration of the one new man. God bless you from Mount Carmel, and may you become a prayer warrior like never before. Let's give the Lord a hand clap.
Hallelujah.